Hello you guys, this is Ralph from DigitalPCGold.com. Um, I got a great email today asking me how do I pass protect my web page. Um, that's very easy to do. What you can do is uh, head over to HostGator. Um, I use this service myself for um, for Digital PC Gold videos. Um, I just pretty much you know, instead of paying for some paying uh, you know for it to uh, get a, uh, some software to do this uh, two three hundred dollars whatever it is to get the software you can just do it through HostGator. You're already paying your fourteen ninety five. Why not use it? Mm -hmm. I mean, unless you're going to have a bunch of uh, people, you know, a ton of ton of ton of ton of people. This way, you can do it. You can control it yourself. And until you, you know, get to a point where you need that type of service, there's no reason to spend two, three hundred dollars. I manage this myself perfectly. I just send send them over to a, a page, give them a temporary email. Once I once they use the temporary email for their for the uh, for the videos, then I send you guys. You guys pretty much know what I do. Then I send you your new uh, username and password. Okay. Um, so it's pretty easy to manage. So what you do is just go to HostGator. Um, I'm assuming everyone has HostGator. I'm assuming most of you guys have HostGator at least. If you don't, it's something similar to this. So you just go down here to your HostGator and scroll down to Securities right here and use your Pass Protect. And then you're going to go into Pass Protect Directory. Okay. So your Pass Protect, direct, pass protect Directory, Password Protect Directories and click on that and then it's going to come up with a file manager directory selection make sure you um, click on web root your public html that's pretty much you know where your 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 web page is okay don't use your document root use the web the web root public html www okay you'll see that um, and then just go ahead and you can select here what you want but uh, I just go ahead and hit go and then it's gonna give you the list of what you wanna pass protect what I'm gonna go ahead and pass protect I'm gonna just gonna go ahead and pass protect the digital PC gold com my main page okay so you know the digital PC videos is pass protected I know many of you guys already know that of course so but this is the basic same thing this is how I do it okay so let's just go in I'm just gonna show you real quick digital PC gold com and click on that and now you're gonna get this screen here password protect directories okay um, right down in here you're gonna have the password protect oh password protect this directory okay so what it says right here it says when a user access the protected directory through the web there will be they will be prompted to enter a username and a password the name that you choose for the protected directory will appear as well okay so here it is password protect this directory so we're gonna uh, mark that with the X or with a check and then name the protected directory I just named it digital PC gold and then you're gonna hit save there so let's watch I'll show you real quick even if you don't put a username in it and a new, a new password and all that you hit save now we go over to digital PC gold right here and then I try to say like I want to access this video it's not gonna let me okay see it already put it up blocked you can't do nothing okay so let's cancel this and let's go back over to our uh, C panel and let's go back and now here we are again and we are going to now I'm going to show you how to create your user name and your password okay so I've already been in here just put a test in here usually we don't block this off so we're just going to do a test do the test one two three and then I'm just gonna put a password as as pass very weak it shows it very you can and actually you can generate a password if you like it generate it'll generate a password like that see so how it generated that for you but we don't want that. I'm just going to do it simple, easy, and just put pass. Okay. Now you hit add, modify, authorized user. So we're going to add them. And now we're going to go back. So now we have the the user test one two three four, and now has been pass and, and now has the password of pass. Okay. So let's go to digital PC gold and we have test one two three four and pass so now if we try to get in here let's just refresh it 
test one two three four and now we press in pass type in pass and now we can get in now we can watch the videos whatever you want to do whatever you're gonna have your uh, web page set up for okay All right, and guys, see so now we're in Let's right, go back here. Quiet this thing up. I know a lot. And go back to our C panel. And let's go back. And now you're gonna see that um, we've, it's been put in. Test one two three four. Okay, the authorized user is test one two three four, and you can delete that so say like if you know after they weren't uh, say like you had a some type of pay site and they weren't paying anymore you can just delete the user um, shut them down from being able to access okay um, that's it though that's how I do it and uh, that's about it you guys that was a great question you guys have any more questions uh, you can post you know post the question if you have any questions um, or uh, email me at digitalpcgold.com or digitalpc gold at gmail dot com okay all right you guys you guys have a good day and you know what let me go double check and make sure well no that it's our digital pc gold at gmail dot com all right you guys can find it in the contact area and all that other than that and then uh, well and then you can delete user and there it is all right you guys you guys have a good day and uh, any more questions like I said just go ahead and post uh, post any questions or uh, go ahead and send me an email. All right, until next video.